Good day resilience! Today, we will discuss the five major functions of communication. Communication serves five major functions such as control, social interaction, motivation, emotional expression, and information dissemination. Now, let us discuss the first major function of communication which is control. Control. This is used in order to literally regulate or control the behavior of people. It is also utilized to regulate the nature and number of activities that people engaged in. You can use this function of communication if you want to ask for a clarification, to stop someone from what they are doing, making suggestions, and giving comments. Now, let's have a look at this example. Hey Dad, look at my new bag. It's pretty, right? Oh yes, where did you get the money that you paid for this bag? From my savings. Why? Is there something wrong? There's nothing wrong with that. But always remember, we are in the middle of pandemic, so we must use our money for our goods and needs. Okay. Social interaction. It is one of the functions of communication that can be used to produce social interaction. It can be used to develop bonds, intimacy, relations, desires, decisions, and connections with others. For us to understand the function of communication under social interactions, let's watch this example. Hi. Oh, hi. May I buy your pen? Sure. Thank you. Welcome. By the way, what's your name? I'm Antoinette. What about you? I'm Winrich. Nice to meet you, Winrich. Nice to meet you too. Motivation. We communicate to entities and direct people to act and reach their objectives or goals in life. In the process, we use positive language to make them realize that their actions lead them to something beneficial for their being. It is also help to boost the confidence of one person or one community. It can also help a person who is a loner. When we control ourselves on communicating, we can build one another confidence. It is important to every individual, a group, and also to an organization that leads us to success. Let's have a look to this example. Sir, sir. Good morning, Sir Santos. This is my office. Oh, hi, Mr. Miguel. I'm glad you are improving. I hope you'll do your best on every activity that you may encounter. Congrats. Thank you, sir. Emotional expression. An emotional expression is a behavior that communicates an emotional state or attitude. It can be verbal or non-verbal and can occur with or without self-awareness. Emotional expression include facial movements like smiling, scolding, and simple behaviors like crying, laughing, or saying thank you. It is necessary to enhance messages and on how we interact with people will determine how they will respond to us and we can control this when we are aware. And for better knowledge, this is our example. Hey bro, are you alright? Actually, I'm not feeling well now. Why? I have family problems and because of this, I cannot go to school anymore. Information dissemination. Information dissemination is a function that conveys information. Information dissemination can also be used to give and get information. Exchange of information is usually done by giving facts and or opinion. For example, Philippines has few reports of being infected with the virus. 